Hello, this is Nick with NicksComputerFix.com and here's a short video on how to reset your Windows 8.1 back to factory settings without losing any data and without a CD. Okay, to start with, let's go ahead and move our cursor over to the right hand corner of our Windows 8 start screen. And once you do that, you open up the Charms menu and then scroll down and click on Settings and then go down to the bottom and click on change PC settings and it opens up the PC settings screen for Windows 8.1 scroll down until you see update and recovery and click on that and then that brings up the update and recovery screen and scroll down to the bottom of the list and click on recovery and then over to the right hand side you get three choices the first one is refresh your PC without affecting your files if your PC isn't running so great, you can uh, return it to um, a functioning, fully functioning operating system um, and without losing your photos or your music, your voice or your data. And uh, all you have to do is go ahead and click on Get Started to make that happen. And they'll come back and say, please wait for a few seconds and because it's preparing those files for you. And once it is um, finished doing that, you'll get this list here that says, refresh your PC and you get uh, not you don't get choices but it lets you know what's gonna happen and the first thing is that your files and personalization settings will not change um, your settings will be changed back to their default um, apps for that matter will um, from the Windows store will be kept of course and apps that you installed from uh, you know disk or um, any websites those are going to be removed however so keep that in mind and then a list of uh, remove apps will be saved on your desktop so you can know which apps to reinstall um, at least uh, you'll know which ones were you know uh, taken off your computer at that time to get started you go ahead and click on next and once you do you go ahead and follow the instructions I'm not going to click on next because I do not personally want to make any changes on my laptop right now so I'm going to click on cancel and then the next item in the list under the update and recovery screen is remove everything and reinstall Windows. So if you want to wipe out everything, and all your data and everything that uh, is on your computer and reinstall um, um, your operating system um, from the beginning, um, basically you reset it back to factory settings. You click on get started and again it'll sit there and go please wait. Uh, preparing the files and uh, this wait period all depends on um, how fast your computer is, is um, able to perform and it tells you what happens and the first thing is all your personal files and apps will be removed and second your PC settings will be changed back to their um, defaults their uh, factory defaults that is so basically everything is wiped out completely clean and if you want that to happen you click on next Again, um, I do not want to do that on my laptop, so I'm just going to go over here and click on cancel, and that way everything on my computer stays the same. Alright, um, the last item on the update and recovery uh, screen is advanced startup. Now, advanced startup is uh, nice if you would like to go ahead and reset your computer back to a... Um, a system image that you created um, at some period during uh, the time that you had your Windows 8.1 running and that will restore it back to that date and time and uh, if you want that to happen all you do is go down here and click on the restart now and that restarts and takes you through the procedure to do that okay um, so you got three ways of um, correcting your issues or your problems that you're having with your computer uh, the choices are yours and uh, or the choice is yours rather and uh, be selective okay that's it for this video subscribe and like my video